Hello again, dudes. This is the True Dude Express here, and I know this isn't the Days of Future Past movie itself because, you know, not on sale, but this is the latest one that I have on me right now, so, uh, just a quick, uh, little vlog to tell you that, guys, that, uh, if you haven't seen it yet, no spoilers in this video, but if you haven't seen it yet, you should really go see it. Great movie. And uh, a lot of the stuff you should be expecting is r a lot of plot twists. You gotta be watching out for them. Time travels, because time travel, you know? And you can't say that's a spoiler, because it was in the trailers. Blah, blah, blah. Anyway, so in this latest version right here, you can see that... Uh, Wolverine still has metal claws. Now, in the Wolverine, uh, the latest Wolverine, I should say, uh, there has been a lot of speculation that it is incorrect because in the end, it, he had bone claws, and in the Days of Future Past movie, he in like trailers and stuff, he had his metal claws. Well, I don't know how to explain that to you, but also, one quick thing, if you're going to stay after the credits, uh, I'm not going to spoil that for you, but you should stay after the credits, and also, if you do, and you don't know who the guys are, the four, horse the four horsemen on the camels are a reference to Apocalypse, and yeah, and also, one last thing, if you're probably wondering, wait, but Gene was dead, and so was Scott, and all those people, and they show him alive in uh, in the past, well, that's because they didn't die yet. So, just tell you guys that, and also, if you haven't got any of the X-Men movie, the best one so far is probably the Wolverine one, or E number two. So, yeah. And, bye. We're out.